Now the other thing is, is Case Keenum will get uh, his second start. He beat uh, the Denver Broncos Thursday night when uh, Dearness Johnson was the only healthy running back. Should have Nick Chubb, knock on whatever might be around. Uh, but Browns are confident in Case Keenum. This is the reason he's here is the backup quarterback. You know, obviously I feel bad for Baker. You know, he's the leader of this football team as our quarterback. Um, you know, losing him hurt. But the great thing about Case is, I mean, he's an amazing young man. I've known Case a long time. We were together in Minnesota. Um, he's always stepped up to the occasion. Um, when it, when his name was called, he's always been there. You know, he led us to the uh, playoffs in Minnesota. I think we ended up 13-3 and three that year, and he was our quarterback for all but one game, I think. Um, you know, he filled in against the Broncos, did a phenomenal job. Uh, thank God we have Case Keenum, I'll be honest with you, because if you had a, a real young quarterback, an experienced quarterback, it might be tougher, but Case is going to run the game plan exactly how it should be run, and, and I know the whole team has confidence in him. And that, that's a really valid point. This is a guy who's been in every situation in the NFL. He's been a starter before. So that is a, a silver lining is that you do have Case Keenum. Yeah, again, um, a lot of fans, for better or for worse, not me, obviously, and then not a lot of people in the media and whatever. But a lot of people think that Case Keenum is the answer uh, at quarterback, and this is your shot. I mean, again, I'm, he's not going to be the quarterback going forward, but uh, you know, you talk about how unhealthy Baker is and how Case should be in there. All right, well, here you go. Here's your giant. Here's here's the opportunity. So, um, the expectation is that Case Keenum comes in and plays well, plays really well. Um, if, if if he's the guy and he's this, you know, this the backup that deserves to play, then he needs to go in there and play. Like, I don't necessarily agree with that. I think he's a backup who's capable and serviceable, but um, and that's what he needs to be in this game. You're lucky that I think that you're going to have Nick Chubb, you're going to have Ernest Johnson, and I think you're going to end up with Kareem Hunt in this game. I don't think Kareem Hunt is a guy who's going to is going to take this lightly. If he's healthy and, and you know, COVID's not affecting him. Um, I think he's going to go. If he was good enough to go in the second half last week, I think he's going to do everything in his power to go this week. I know that people have said he's doubtful, but he's been you know, posting on Instagram that he's ready to roll. and So I believe him. So you have your full contingent of running backs. Um, Case is going to have to get the ball out quickly. Max Crosby, Yannick Ngakwe can get after the quarterback. Um, they got to have a good game plan to, neg uh, to negate those guys, but – I think they're going to do a good job. I think Case Keenum's going to come in and be the service serviceable quarterback that they need. I just wouldn't expect him to, you know, throw for 300 yards in this game.